I'm talking about taking the entire visceral experience of cooking and eating and putting it online. We're just call it minimalist. Drop the. It's cleaner that way. We're making strawberry, fool. But I wasn't calling you names. A strawberry fool is strawberries mixed with, in this case, whipped cream, but you could use pretty much any dairy, heavy cream, sour cream, yogurt for that matter. Um, and it's a minimalist from 1999, a real classic because it is as basic as dessert gets, and especially in strawberry season, just perfect. What I did here was take uh, my strawberries in and combine them with some sugar. If you're starting with great strawberries, you'll use less sugar. If you're starting with off-season sort of hard strawberries, you might want to use a little more, but in either case, you'll get this beautiful sort of syrupiness. And the strawberries will juice up, which makes them sweeter. Obviously, adding the sugar makes them sweeter also. And it's the same principle as salting eggplant, for example, which will draw out some of the eggplant's liquid. Um, in this case, we're saving all the liquid, though, because what we're going to do is puree half of the strawberries and leave the other half chopped up. So we're going to have a nice little melange of textures. So half goes into the blender. It can be a little more or a little less than half. This doesn't have to be precise. And now you have your smoothie. This doesn't have to be perfectly pureed. You can make it juicier or less juicy. It's all up to you. Just mix that for a second. This is a cup of cream mixed with a little bit of vanilla and a quarter cup or so sugar. And you see it's whipped pretty stiff because we need to give this fool some body here. So I'd stir, pretty aggressively stir some of it in there. Mix it well. That is it. You can refrigerate this for an hour or two or you can eat it right away, which is what I'm going to do. And as you can see, it's pretty nice. And you're varying the texture, you're adding a little sweetness, you're adding some creaminess, but basically you're staying very close to home and really um, taking advantage of the strawberry's flavor.